So today, my boy is gonna try to install this for me. Hold on, let me unbox the shit for you guys. It's a, basically the bird's eye view for my Accord. Well, for any car, but I'm gonna put it on my Accord. Um, let me, can this one here? Find out, boys. Ah, motherfucker, okay. Boom. How's that? These are the mats to calibrate um, the bird's eye view from the left mirror, right front camera, and the rear. You put those on each side so they can calibrate it all. That's all that comes with right there. Comes with a card. That shit on my face. Hey yo, shut up! Alright, we got this. Like I said, 360 bird's eye view. Feel me, fam? But we'll see. Boom. Instructions right there, you feel me? All the instructions. Super HD 1080p. My ass. That should be like 480. It also comes with uh, the drill bit. So you can cut it. I mean, so you can make the holes for the, for the mirrors. So you can put the, the cameras in it. This is the sensor. It's a shock sensor. Okay, there you go. I heard that for this, I think. You use this for, um, to change the, like let's say if you want to keep the front camera always on when you're driving or the rear camera, you use this. That's, that's what I heard. But I could be wrong. So, put this like this. I think you lift it up. Yes, sir. Okay, so, this is the shock, what is it? The shock sensor, boom. That's one. This is one of the cameras. Wait, is the camera? Mm, no, it's not a camera. This is the other sensor. This is a camera. They're all color coordinated too. As you can see, I'm colorblind, but I think this is blue. Could be purple, you know. So you connect that one to where is it at? The purple one, the blue one, whatever the fuck color it is. Two over here, see? So it's blue, purple. Connect that. I think it's the front camera right here. This is one of the mirrors cameras. Comes with little grommets so it will face the right angle after you drill the fucking holes. See? Like diagonal little. The other camera for the mirror. It also comes with this is also supposed to use as a dash camera as well. Supposedly, so you have this to give you a free 16 gigs of USB storage for that shit. Uh, these are all the wires. And I think this is the front camera. No, this is the rear camera. Um, I'm gonna. Well, my boy is gonna connect it all first just to see if it, if it's all working. And if it isn't, then he's gonna have to figure something out. Or yeah, we'll see when I get over there. To install the TSX mirrors. Fuck. I'm gonna take off the oven right now and I'm gonna fucking mount these. I think we have to make a hole. Um, over there where the fucking thing is at. I'm gonna do a little time lapse. Watch. So what I did so far was I took off these right here. Oh, let me focus on that shit. Took off these from right here and from down here. I seen a video where this, he said you gotta take these off. This one falls in good still the hole. And you have to break off this little piece from back here. My bitch. You have to break this little piece. That right there break it off because it doesn't give it any clear I mean if you cut it, it gives it clearance I freaking put like a little let me see a little down on purpose right here right there and that's where that hole is at right there this one so 
I need a drill hole a little bit higher over here. So it should be like, can you see this? Should be like around a little bit over here or something. Mounted. This shit. Ooh, I'll show you the holes right now. Oh, it's just that angle that goes. Wait, the hole over here. Original? Maybe no. That is Ain't going nowhere, son. So, like I was saying, look at the original hole right here, and I put it all the way over there for the, for, the, for that shit to fit. Original, I drilled it over there so it could fit. That's about it. Tell me where the fuck you want it, bro. Let me see. Go where the, the Honda sign was at, like you said, like right here. I think right here would be good, like right at the two. You think so? Mm -hmm. You have to push him up like yeah, a little bit. Oh my god. Yeah, like right, we want to like right in the middle. Like, you, you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. And I'm going back, baby. I don't have my stock on here. What? You got me here in the logo. What happened? I got shit fucking just fell out. She got the little white lines for that reason then to point them out. I thought we I thought I fucked it up and had it like that. Bitch, can you not focus? So where you put the what's that the ground made set? In the box right there. What are you trying to do? If you break those shit, I can't screw it back in, remember that. Thank we though. Just fish that shit through there, Poppy. You'll be good. Let me try again. Oh, you put it in through there, I haven't noticed that. Problem, huh? Mm-hmm. All right, because... The camera? Fish it right through there, and it comes out... Sure Babooski. There you go. Well, it shouldn't be the same? picture of this I could put it on the video. Camera through where I do over here or it's gonna come to the engine bay. Oh to the fucking firewall. I'm gonna put it like over here so it won't be too like too noticeable. Oh my goodness. It's gonna be like 
I see. What about right here? It's way too noticeable. Hit the, the left one. in the center it looks a little cheese a -roni. You didn't see that shit? It went through right there. He scratched it right there, but fuck you ain't gonna see it. What happened? Now we're just gonna put alcohol around this way to clean it. And then smack that shit on with double sided tape. So we finally finished with that uh, bird's eye view shit for this. Um last time I showed you I didn't show you that it was already calibrated but I'm gonna show you how to calibrate it because I didn't record it. All you gotta do is, let me see, turn this shit on so we can go to the little thing, okay? All you gotta do is press the menu button, boom. Wait, yeah, boom. So you're here, boom, ski. You always said it's birds, well, bird view calibration. The code is three ones, so just one, wait, one, one, one. Then go to okay. Fucking dust. I uh, I'm not gonna click it myself, but then it's all scratched up. Let me take this off. Whoa, shit looks man. Anyways, um, as before you click on the auto calibrate, you gotta put the mats down that they show you. I mean, that, they, that it comes with the little checkered uh mats. I'll show you right now. I'm gonna go get one real quick. All right, look. See his mats? Well, yeah, these mats, whatever the fuck it's called. You take them and put them on each camera. This right here, when you open it, is gonna have these lines. You match these lines with the lines of the camera. On the camera, it's gonna be a circle like that. And it has a white little line saying, um, showing you like that's the way they have to face it out the car. Like for these right here, the side mirrors, the line has to be pointing outwards over there, straight out. Same thing with the left one, so pointing straight out over there. The front one, obviously, is you just put in the front and the back and the back. So when you put these on, make sure you align these right here, these little strips, with the actual camera strips, well, the white lines. The front and the rear doesn't have any, so just, just put it exactly where the camera is as in the front. Um, and that's about it. After you do that, it has to be like, I think it's like four inches away from the car a little bit, but after you do that, you use it auto cow and it calibrates it for you and it'll turn the let me see what's the fucking remote at. It'll turn it like this. Let me go back. Binky. Boom ski. It'll turn it like that so you can see everything. See how you can see all of that shit? There you go. That's the whole 360. It's kind of warped right here because um the camera how I put it in the rear, I didn't put it exactly at, um in the middle. I put it like towards the left a little because the, the light was there in the way. But I'm gonna go for a little drive and I'm gonna show you guys that that shit actually works. All right, so I'm gonna show you how it is. I have to roll, I have to drive around with my hazards on because that's how I set it up for the front camera. So I'm gonna show you how it looks. It's kind of hard with this big ass camera. So let me see. I'm gonna go around the block real quick, but oh my goodness, it's fucking huge. That's what she said. Look at that. So it's kind of warped in the back because, uh, like I told you, the camera is not centered in the middle. Oh my goodness. I'm doing my best at recording at the same time. All right, so. Give me a sec. You got to turn right here with no power steering. Like that, I don't know. There's 
music right there, boom. You see right on the side right there. Let me go over right here, boom. Took a turn right here. Ate that sidewalk a little because I can't see. But yeah. Look at that. Oh, there's beep. I'm coming through. So the car's right there. Oh, shit. I'm coming in hot. There it goes. The car coming right in front of me. Let's see if you can see it there. There it is. See that shit? Oh, shit. Got a fucking Mercedes, my boy Tesla over here. There you go. Just stun your boys, you know what I'm saying? Tell them niggas that you got a fucking Lamborghini on. Look at that. Boom, baby. Boomski, baby. And we're good. So my boy told me that this shit was pretty difficult to install just because this specific radio from Xtrons, it has like different inputs for, um, let me show you right here. Got different inputs for different like cameras and shit. So it says front camera and just like for like, uh, if you want to put like a fucking Xbox or something in here. So we didn't know exactly which one we had to put on which uh, thing. So we tried it with everything and it, it was working, but it wasn't working how I wanted it. Like when I hit reverse, I wanted it to actually go to reverse. So what he did, I mean what he did, what he found was there was one yellow one. This is if you got the same one as me. He there's one yellow one that you can connect to the little um the little I guess port you can say, whatever the fuck, the little thing where you plug in the Xbox or the you know the old school consoles or whatever. You know the red the red, white, and yellow fucking cables. There was a yellow one for video. He plugged it into that one, but it didn't work. Well, it worked, but it didn't work like how I wanted to, like I said. So we found one that was a brown one that said, I think it was video set on it as well. But he thought since it was, you know, supposed to be video, it was yellow. So we took a while to figure that out. We plugged it in and that's saying it worked. So it comes with the instructions in this box. So you don't have to fucking do exactly how I did it. It's all different for depending on which radio you get, you know, but the instruction shows you exactly how to do it. It just tells you to, it's literally plug and play. Each, like the right one, the left fucking camera, the front, the rear, they have specific colors. Like I think the right one is red, the left one is yellow, the back is black, and the front is blue, whatever. And you just uh, attach it to the little box that it gives you. And that's it. After that, you read the instructions. It shows you where you're supposed to connect it to, to what, and that's it. It's pretty simple. But yeah, everything works. Look, I'm gonna put it in reverse. Boom, it does it automatically. There you go, bird's eye view, reverse camera. Boom, skip, take it off. It goes back. The front right here, you hit that to put the front. There you go. Take it off, it takes it off. Left turn signal, left side, same thing with the right. Um, I think these are pointless because you don't see nothing besides the sidewalk, barely, because you see how it looks like that. This camera, these the side cameras are not meant to be looking at it like this. It's supposed to be just so it could turn it, so you can see this, the bird's eye view. Because on the, you know, the newer cars, you don't see this, it just does that. But if you want to take that off, you could take it off. Just don't um, put it straight to the fucking, um, to make it work with this and that's it. What I was gonna do, I said it like plenty of times, I was gonna get two buttons so I can activate the turning signals. So, well, not the turning signals, the cameras, the left and the right. So whenever I wanna um, see the, bird, the bird's eye view, instead of fucking hitting the hazards, I can just click the two buttons, the left and right, um, one for the left cam, one for the, re, uh, for the right. So if I were to click both of them, it would act like it was using this so I could just see the front camera or the left or rear. So that's what I was into. That's an idea for you guys if you guys want to use it like that. But yeah, um, this bad boy right here, the specific uh, brand, it's not, it's not bad. Uh, I'll put the link in the description like I always do. But the quality could be better, like a lot better, because it's pretty booty cheeks. So just saying, look, I'm sorry. This side, it looks perfect. Like it looks good. You don't need to see this shit high quality as fuck. But this right here. I don't know, um, the camera looks decent, but it's pretty shit quality because it's not like HDMI or, it says it's 1080p, but it's using component, uh, you know, using component fucking display, so it's pretty booty cheeks. So don't expect to have some HD ass shit, like super HD, but it gets the job done, it's good. 
I'll give it a fucking 9 out of 10. I am definitely going to put it in one of my other vehicles when I get it because I'm going to sell this Accord and get myself like a MDX or a Pilot so, uh, so I can make an off-road build. But when I do get that shit, I'm going to definitely put the same one again or look for a more HD one. But this does exactly what it said it does. It does it good. But it's good, so... um. If you want to copy it, I have the link in the description. That's about it. What else can I say? It does what it says it's going to do. I'm editing this video right now, but I forgot to mention the little box that it comes with that you plug in all the cameras to. Do not put that anywhere there's a lot of, that there's a lot of wires because that shit gets pretty fucking hot. So put it somewhere that's a little bit ventilated, you know, the air gets through or some shit. Don't put it where there's a lot of wires though. So I gotta say.